What is up, world? My name is Miracle, because YouTube, and welcome to Postmod or Shield. With the game just about over, people are playing a lot of Season 13, but also people are playing a lot of the Spike Myth tournaments. As you can see, I am searching for my opponent. Uh, I am playing against someone from my Discord server named Krebs. He's a very nice builder, very nice player, very nice dude. Um, have not gotten the chance to play him too much, um, but I will today, as soon as he responds to my messages. Um, if you're new, welcome. Uh, I play competitive Pokemon. I have been playing Pokemon for 12 years now, a little, a little under 12 years. Uh, I'm still very bad at the game, and how I'm especially bad this go around because I have been focusing not only on school but also the trading card game. Um, ironically enough, I started building for season 13 just to say, hey, I want to make some content. It's the uh, same exact core I've been building in the TCG. Love to see it. Um, where is this dude? So I will be playing a team. I am searching right now. I don't know if that will interrupt it. Um, the shiny Eternatus, even. Um, I will be playing this team. I haven't really touted. I haven't really tested it. Uh, I look forward to playing it. I look forward to playing Krebs. And... Once he gets back, I will hop into the battle. But I am playing this for Yoshifu, Zapdos, Tapu Fini, Serena, Naganadal, and Enten. And there we go. And now we will hop into battle. Uh, just wait. Oh. I'm a little scared, I'll be honest. Because I am very rusty. I haven't tested my team a lot. Uh, <laughs> so this is going to be a very interesting match. I'm hoping for a good good game. He's a good guy. Good builder. I have no idea what he's playing, actually. Uh, there's my... There's all my items. As you can see, I'm still testing a little bit. So some of my items are off. Uh, next, by the next video, they will be, by the next video, they will be all set. And without further ado, let's hop into the battle. Oh, it's stuff. Man, of us team. I played against him, this team, a couple days ago. And he beat me 2-0. Like, easy clap. He just... Tyranitar has super power, I know that. And that. Uh, I meant to put Regilecki. That Zapdos, or the Mandibus is so bulky. I need this. Tapu Fini and Zapdos. I forgot to recalc my Tapu Fini. Uh, Serena doesn't do much. I don't know if I should bring Naganadal or not. No, it's gonna have speed. I have no way to break, really break through this sum. Um, the sand core, actually. Like, the Dracovish. I just don't know how to deal with it. I'm not 
not. I'm not. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna try this. I'm kind of hard focusing that Manda Buzz, but like, I need to. <laughs> This, this works out against the um, sand lead as well. I don't think the vicious branch should be able to end up a key train. Alright. So that mandibus is probably gonna snarl on us. Um, how do I play it? Should I hard focus the mango? What can E Train do? I'm not playing one. What do I have on here? Why am I playing one? Uh! And if anyone's asking about U Turn, it's because of uh, ground types like Landorus T. I want to uh, get out of there. Bolt switch ain't gonna work. What am I? I'm gonna hard. I'm gonna hard focus the man buzz, and I'm gonna ice beam. Oh, that did a lot. And the paralysis. Ooh, that did a lot. That did a lot. Heat wave comes out. Uh, effective. Not that many ice beams. That is nice. That mandibus has caused me a lot of damage last time. So, no tailwind, no snarls. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Now is when I U-turn and muddy water. That heat train is probably not staying in. It's not weakness policy, I remember that. Probably my send in your sheep. I'm gonna make a hard read this turn if Entei does not eat. Okay. There you go. That's the waters. If I live, I'm going to. Oh. Ah, he did it. Did it? Yes. Okay. And my berry pops and the safe goggles that should be fine. I am going to sacred fire into the e trans slot. And I know that very that's pretty risky. But that was dazzling gleam. I should pale. And if I, he switches out, he protects. Now I don't think. Fire. Now he knows what that play was. Uh, not substitute, I remember that. I think he has flash. Ooh. Miss, 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 miss. And take perfect. Absolutely perfect. He doesn't go down, that's nice. I'm trying to all three. Okay, so now he knows I'm gonna sacred fire into that slot. I'm going to sacred fire and 
muddy water. I kind of want to protect, but then I'm going to be low on eight. I'm going to hit him with another muddy water. He trained to use protect, but it failed. How's he doing? Water. I don't understand why he was trying to double protect. Keeping it around for one more turn. He has that pink emission attack, right? Now it's nine, this is Capitini's last turn, unless I switch it out. Sent out Drake Rush. So now what? Uh two more turns of sand. I think I'm I think he thinks I'm going to I'm gonna try to chip it. Extreme speed and I'm gonna call it. I'm going to attack with both actually. I want that burn. Because ah. Yeah, that would do it. I, uh, I thought he was going to fish his friend. That makes sense. Uh, so what do I do from here? Mist is gone. Fish is through. This, this should be the last turn of sand. One more turn. So this is a attack and protect. That first attack. And then here's the detect. Because black light. And, and, and then now is when I just attack. I, my focus ash is preserved, not really here to do. Uh, which one does one? Critical is 1.5. I'm gonna hit close combat, because straight close combat. Jacob uh, is just actually one. He orphans. Alright. Um, so what did I learn? He played that Mandibuzz. He's probably going to play it differently. Do I bring the... No, I think the Mons that I brought were good. It's just I don't have the best matchup into his team. Um, let's see. Let's see. He, I have yet to see his Comfy, and I have yet to see his real ability. I'm going to... Hmm. I don't think he's going to bring Heatran again. Heatran got off two moves and fainted on the double protect. Um, I don't think he's going to bring it again. Unless he brings Comfy for Trick Room, which I can see happening. No. He definitely brings... Do I want to try now? I have no speed. That's my issue with the bits. I'm going to lead Yoshifu this time. Capitini and... I bring the Ente. Yes, I, I bring the Ente every time. Um... Because even if I can just get burns onto things, that starts doing good, uh, good chip. If he brings Rillaboom, that's good. Uh, goggles made it pretty good into the sand. If I can play a turn... Okay. okay. I know what I'm going to do. So... 
Yoshifu dies this time. I can tell you that right now. Ah, I have hard. Hmm. It's hard for me to go into this. I'm going to start to punch and break a bit. No, I should have close combat into. Damn it! I messed up. I think Krebs got this one. I should have um, used close combat into the Tyranitar. Because even if it's... You, you can't protect in front of it. And I'm dying this turn anyway. So I guess... That's damage, I guess? But yeah. Power, yeah. No, because if you use Fish's Rend, it zap those. Uh, now I can bring out Tapu Fini. I don't think I would be able to have him lead that. He knows I have Muddy Water. He knows I have... No, I did use Bazzling Blade. Um, so he knows my entire moveset on the Fini. So, I'm going to zap those dots. I'm just going to do it, just Thunderbolt, and then that's going to be Because Vicious Wrench should not KO even with the double damage. I hope not. He's not in choice fan. Special moves, special attacks are going to do more. I could probably extreme speed and dazzling gleam. No, I want a sacred fire into the Manitar. There's nothing that Mandibuzz can do. It can foul play? That will do a lot. But if I can get the burn onto. Yeah. If I can get the burn. Then that makes it significantly easier. Sacred Fire and. Pardon. Uh, another Dazzling Gleam? Dazzling Gleam is. I think it's my best option. If that Mandibus starts clicking things like Snarl, that will do. Really. Yep. Now I'm 68. That's the clean comes out. Unless something crazy happens. Yeah. That's me. Now the mandibles can start clicking snarl, and there's just nothing really that I can do to it. I'm gonna try to protect Mighty Water Queen. Muddy Water does more, so I'm gonna try. And this does cover for a Heatran switch. But now he has Tailwind up, so yeah. Now he can Rock Slide, Snarl. Yep, there's the Snarl, unless it misses, which I will. Yep. I get him onto the Mandibus Hype Train. I get. I actually hype up Mandibus all the time. And then now I lose to it. I tell people that Mandibus is good. Oh, that's a little annoying. But, what's the game look like? And I... Yep, I think. Unless I can get a double or a miss. That... Not getting the burn means I could have lived a little longer, done some chip. I'm gonna hope for a burn. 
And I already ate my berry, so. A burn and a crit. <laughs> I need it. I need you to miss a rock slide, get burned. I need my muddy water to crit. I need my fish to shut up. Mm. Damn it. Alright. Drake is down. And I punch. Alright, good game. Alright. Um So how do I go into game three? Game three I need to. I need to lead Tapu Fini. I because Yeah, not leading Tapu Tapafini Urshifu? Yeah, that's what I should have read. Tapafini Urshifu. Run into it. No, what do I do against man? I need Zapdos in the back end? No, it leads no. I need I need to lead Tapafini and Oh Zapdos. Foul play comes out, not gonna KO, I know that. Back, crunch comes out, not gonna miss. KOs, GG Krebs, game three. So I need to lead Zapdos. If he leads the Sand Core again, I should not get KO'd turn one. I can get a free Dazzling Gleam off at least. If he leads... Yeah. I think he read that for tech too well. I should have. Uh, do I do I lead Cap Capafini and Urshiku? That should be my lead. Because I can Yeah. Sucker Punch and Dazzling Gleam if he leads to Capafini. Serena doesn't it looks like it does a lot, but he doesn't have a lot of... It only blocks the Rillaboom, which he has not been bringing. And I don't think he will, because my team... I have three resists on the bot. Four resists to it. It's not doing too much. Um, and he's playing around the Tapafini with neutral hits. So I bring the Zapdos. He sets up Hailwind turn one. That will be an issue. But... It, it's either he sets up Tailwind, in which case I zap those Yoshifu double into it, or he has the Sand Duo, in which case I Sucker Punch and... Do I? No, I'm gonna... I close combat, because I have the Sash, I live the hit, I die regardless, and then Tapu Fini eats a... Rock slide? I have yet to see the company and that kind of scares me. But Alright, game three. Let's do this, Krebs. Does bring the real of 
emergency valve. So my Tapafini is no longer safe. Push the out into the Tapafini. Does about half. Close combat. Yeah, that needs to get Doesn't mean. So that's the break of it gone. Okay, so I keep my sash. Uh, I'm going to protect your people and not let that happen. I'm going to double protect because I need to burn his fake out. Not have dragon dance. To double detect, he burn his fake out, in my sash, and then I'm going to close combat into the real of I'm probably losing Tapafini for this fake out. Yoshiku got it. And superpower into Yoshiku. That's fine. That's fine, that's fine. And I'm going to bring out... It seems very risky. But I'm going to bring out Entei here. Entei in the tap of So, close combat. And Entei. Because I know I survive a rock slide, unless it crits. I survive the rock slide. I can... Still have a bad by the end of the turn. Okay, slide. Okay, that's nice. I do not live a rock slide at this time. Ooh, he lives it. That's not good. Uh, if he used superpower, I'm done. Yep. Does the extreme speed pay out? Whatever it is, I can, I can take the fire and turn it. Which 
Which slide is it? Ow. I think he's going to switch out you. That works too. That worked very well. Fire. Now I'm mad. Water comes out. Protect. Gone, no more sandstorm. And if I switch out, I have drink. So you can't flinch. You're going to heal. I might. Um, I'm going to double protect. No. Yeah, I'm going to double protect with some healing. Switch out. No, I need to. Get some healing on Tapu Fini at least. And I'm going to extreme speed into you. Um, and hope this did it. Heatran, I can pretty cleanly take care of. Thunderbolt and Muddy Water will hopefully do what they need to do. He's probably going to. Fake out Tapafini and Earth Power into Entei. Um, any protect. This is healing. Healing. Fake out. Okay. He knows. He goes, uh, does Entei not have stomping tantrum? Nope. <laughs> He's playing around it the whole time. He'd love to see it, love to see it. And Zap goes in. Alright. GG Krebs, uh, this should seal it up. Zap goes Thunderbolt, it's Light Orb. Yeah. There, there is no way. And Zapdos the boys. Good game, Krebs. Good game. Love to see it. Love to see it. Muddy water. And it hits. And it gets the drop. Alright, alright. I defeated Krebs. Alright, so that was some... Um, those are some close games, actually. I kind of wrapped up the second one, or the third one pretty cleanly but that could have gone very in the other direction very quickly so what i've learned with this team is i need to be very careful i'm going to rental communicate yeah no i'm going to view it as a team So 
this is the team that I was using. I will maybe make it public. I I'm going to modify it and then make it public. I don't know how. I'm going to definitely change the Zapdos set. Definitely move things around. The Entei was nice. Um, Entei did put in some work. Ha not having Sacred Fire or Stomping Tantrum was a little awkward against something like the Heatran. But all in all, having Yoshifu, having Tapu Fini, uh, an offensive Zapdos, I definitely need to change the setup. I know I've said that before. U Turn did put in some work, so I'm probably going to change out Weather Ball. Uh, U-Turn gave some good chip into the Tyranitar when I needed to. It did good work, actually. Um, so I'm probably... I'm going to keep U-Turn on there. I know the Serena, I need to learn how to play a little better. Uh, I don't use it that often, but I haven't played too often. So I'll see you about the Serena. And then a couple videos down the line, I will have this team posted. But... On that note, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked this video, let me know in the comment section down below. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and have a nice day. Signing off.